Okay, so top 10 things never to say to your wife. Number one, are you expecting? Now honestly, it amazes me how many times this etiquette no no occurs. A slight weight gain or protrusion in the tummy area does not justify anyone to ask such a question. So never ever ever say that to your wife. Keep your mouth set. Okay, number two, you're just like your mother. These words should only be spoken as a compliment. Because if the intent is anything else, it can determine whether he sleeps tonight or not. And that's the truth. So Dennis, if you hear this, listen up carefully, okay? All right. Number three, you look good, but you're no Cindy Crawford. Oh, him no. It's never appropriate to even restrict praise or make it even conditional, especially if he's no Robert Redford. So that, never, 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 never. Okay. Ah. Number four, which I can't stand, is have you tried putting the spoons upside in the dishwasher instead of down? First of all, it's my kitchen, bitch. Get out of it. I stick to hammering your nails and going to work and making a paycheck. That's what I'm talking about. Hmm. Anyway. <laughs> okay, number five. Are you gonna really eat all that? Are you serious? Never ever say that to your woman. I don't care how much she's eating, don't ever say that. Cause that means you ain't getting her, you know what I'm saying? Just leave her alone, thank you honey. Okay, um, number six. Oh, by the way, I invited the boss and his wife over tonight for dinner. Never ever surprise her like that. Never ever. A woman likes to prepare. We like to get ready. Three hours, four hours, five hours in advance. You surprise us like that? Actually, we like to get noticed like days in advance cause we need to prepare. We need to find out what we're gonna wear and whatever. Never surprise us like that, remember that. Okay, number seven. If I had known that we were gonna have broccoli tonight, I would've eaten at work. Really? Because we cook all the time. Well, some of us don't cook all the time, but really? You're gonna stay at work, so you know what? Guess what? You're gonna be eating at work every single night. Mm hmm Don't ever say that. Don't ever say that. Okay, um, my mother made the best blueberry, blueberry, blueberry pie ever. First of all, don't ever compare what I make with your mother, your ex-wife, your ex-girlfriend, your ex, I don't care who it is. Don't ever say that. Anytime we make something, you need to say, honey, that was the best. You're the best cook ever. Okay? Okay. Number nine. Do you want to maybe like comb your hair before we leave? Oh, hell no. We know what to do. When we know that we look good, we look like, just shut up. You want to want to say something nice? Just say, honey, you look beautiful tonight. But don't be saying shit like that. No good, no good. Don't do it. Okay. Okay. The, the most important, when a woman gets stressed and she says, honey, does this outfit make me look fat? Your answer is no, honey, you look beautiful. Don't say, um, or even pause. Like when she says, honey, does this make me look fat? Don't even look at her for more than a second and not say anything. Just say, no, sweetheart, you look beautiful, you look beautiful. That's it. Once you say, yeah, you know what, it doesn't make your ass look fat, that's it, you're done. You're done, homeboy, you're done. Because nobody got time for you because you ain't looking so great yourself, okay? Whatever. So, okay, that's my top ten things never to say to your wife, girlfriend, whatever. If you have some, please add them down below. Bye-bye.